What is going on, Ship Army? It is Ahmed, and I am back today with yet another video for you all. Just dropping in this morning to give you guys a quick update regarding whale positions when it comes to SHIB. Now, remember, as always, I like to preface by saying that I'm not a financial advisor, just putting you guys on the plays that I'm in. And if you are new around here, consider smashing the like button down below and subscribing. Now, SHIB is up about 1% over the last couple of hours. Not much going on in terms of crypto. The market is just, you know, doing its consolidating thing where people are trying to figure out, is it time to get in? Is it time to not? But looking at mother Bitcoin here, honestly, over the seven last seven days after the sell-off, we've seen just some strong support and consolidation right around $22,400. So with that being said, in terms of people getting ready to maybe increase their positions, it might be a reasonable time to consider doing so. But remember, you got to make that decision for yourself. Now, before we dive in and talk about the whale positions, I want to mention one quick thing. As we enter times of uncertainty in terms of finances, even in crypto and other markets, understand there are still ways to make money on the side. ChatGPT and AI are taking the world by storm, and I've been trying to identify ways to utilize artificial intelligence and AI on my other channel to supplement your income. So you can get paid, as I wrote here, $225 every hour with ChatGPT. And in the video I walk you through, it's less than five minutes, so go ahead and check it out. The link will be pinned right at the top of the description and in the comment section below. So make sure you guys check it out and get informed on ways to supplement your income as we enter times of uncertainty. So again, even if you're working a nine to five right now, that might not be the case in the next six to 12 months, as we know layoffs do happen during times of recession. Now, 54 trillion, 308 billion, 468 million, 786,386 Shiba Inu tokens are now in the hands of the world's largest Ethereum whales. I had to read that number from beginning to end because it's so significant. 54 trillion tokens being held by the largest Ethereum whales. Shiba Inu has cemented its status as the largest altcoin holding amongst the 500 biggest whales on ETH, according to the blockchain tracker Whale Stats. Over $606 million in SHIB, representing about 54 trillion tokens at the current price, are sitting in the deep pocketed investors' wallets. According to Whale Stats, the whales' SHIB holdings outweigh their other altcoin positions by a vast margin. Ethereum scaling solution Matic, the second biggest altcoin holding for the majority of these whales, currently, currently trails SHIB by nearly 440 million US dollars. The top 500 ETH whales shows their respective positions there. And folks, I kid you not, whenever you look at these kind of statistics and you look at the in investors that are in the space that have a significant amount of liquidity and capital to deploy on whatever token or ecosystem they want to, and they choose SHIB over Matic, over Link, over Best, over Uniswap, Locus, Mana, other respectable tokens that are in the infrastructure of that is crypto. When we see there's almost a three, four X position holding of SHIB compared to or relative to the others, it should raise eyebrows. It should make you think, why? Speculation has it, of course, a number of Ethereum wills have been spotted rapidly accumulating Shiba Inu over the last several months as the Dogecoin rivals ecosystem gears up for the launch of Shibarium, a layer two scaling project meant to make network more efficient. So we know what's happening with Shibarium and I see the things that on social media, especially even in my own comment section here on YouTube, so many individuals have been so negative saying, Shibarium's never coming. Why are you continuously talking about it? These are people who are probably holding 30 to $40, $50 positions down, purchased at all time highs, and don't really have conviction for this token or ecosystem. They bought in because of the news, the hype, the meme, the excitement of it, but didn't really pay attention to the true utility. But these whales holding millions of dollars each and $606 million across these 500 individual wallets, why are they still holding? Why do they have conviction? Ask yourself that question once or twice before you make the decision to sell off your own position. Because I know right now there has been uncertainty. We wish the market would already start to turn around and turn bullish. But real money is made 
during bear markets, accumulating your positions, paycheck after paycheck, 1% of each paycheck, if that's your risk appetite, 0.5%, 10%, whatever that number is for you, you make that decision and buy assets that you believe in. Because when you buy the assets that you truly do believe in, you will buy the dip. And if you don't, then of course, you're going to run away for a loss and regret that you ever got in. And when it surges again, you're going to say, why did I sell? I appreciate you guys' support as always. So thank you all so much for tuning in. That's all I have for you guys today. There will be a link down in the description below for Mumu. Get your free stocks as always down in the description. And until next time, everybody, as always, keep investing. Peace.